Rio de Janeiro, host of the 2016 Summer Olympics, is a place unlike any other. The coastal city is expecting over half a million foreign visitors for the games. And for tourists on a tight budget, an inexpensive day may seem unrealistic. Luckily for you, we paired up with Rio native, or Carioca, Gabriela Breu. What's up, dude? <laughs> to show us how you can maximize a day in the city for a minimal price. First, we headed to the Fiera Livre, a weekly street market to try fresh Brazilian fruits and veggies. For only $3, visitors can get a cooked breakfast and tasty drinks made with ingredients straight from the Amazon. The fair is a very fun place. People are joking and there is always a good atmosphere. People enjoy being here, including the workers. Don't forget to try the samples. Next, head to Copacabana Beach to try a staple of Brazilian culture, coconut water. You can find vendors just about anywhere on this two and a half mile strip. So kick up your feet on the shore while you sip this nourishing nectar. It's part of the culture of Brazil, the culture of Rio de Janeiro, coconuts and caipirinhas. They are the symbol of Rio. A trip to Rio wouldn't be complete without a visit to Christ the Redeemer. Catch a ride on a mountainside train that takes you directly to the statue, offering breathtaking views of the city from high above. By now, our stomachs were growling, so our tour guide brought us to a hole-in-the-wall restaurant called Santa Clara Pensal. Since many tourists can't find this hidden gem tucked tightly in its Copacabana neighborhood, prices stay low for a delicious lunch. To have an idea, this dish I've just eaten is dry meat, tutu and rice. It's 14 reais here. If I go to a restaurant, I would pay 70. So I can eat four dishes here for the price of one in another restaurant. As the day comes to a close, walk to Impanema Beach for a gorgeous sunset. Those that want to keep the party going can listen to live music dance and meet new people at one of the many beach bars along the shore. It's impossible to stay at home. It's cooler by the beach and it's refreshing and fun. With one final stop at Fiera Noche in Copacabana, we were able to pick up a traditional Brazilian pastel made with carne for dinner, which means we kept this fun-filled day packed with Brazilian sights, food and culture to just $50. Not bad for a vacation on a budget. For azcentral.com, I'm Alex Capriello in Rio de Janeiro.